Welcome back. So today we will revise some uh, linear function and coordinate geometry type question. This is a uh, Nuyet exam style uh, question, so but we don't have here some choices, but uh, never mind. So we need to make sure that we can solve these uh, types of problem. Eh? Okay, the question is in the diagram A and B is the point that we know the coordinates. We need to find the coordinates of C. So it says that the line L passes through A and this is parallel to OB. Okay, so L, L1, this is parallel to OB. And we have the second point, which is L2. This is perpendicular to AB. Okay, this is lines. So we need to uh, revise some properties of, of lines. The lines L1 and L2 meet at C. We need to find the coordinates of C. Okay, guys, uh, my... My advice yeah, is to, when you solve some problem, you need to know your uh, path. So, how you are going to solve it. Okay, so, I guess this video I can uh, record in three languages. So, that's why I will switch between them. То есть, хранзар, любой есепты шығарған кезде, яма, негізі на... Past to обрисенезер, смотри, то есть, допустим, вот это там, ну, да, давайте вот это problem, да, мы сказали, Pro problem uh, given, то есть, что нам дано. And we have here, let's say, some, what we need to find, yeah? find something, yeah? find something. And in order to solve any questions, if you know, let's say, some paths, to solve, то есть именно қалай шығару керек екенін білсеңіздер, то есть сондай болады ғой, бір идея, да, то есть именно маған вот point C ді тап деу үшін нені тау керек, а оң тау үшін енді, а оң тау үшін енді тау керек, тау керек, тау керек, тау керек, тау керек, backward, back, back, word approach, то есть именно арт жақтан бастау, то есть бұл реально жақсы өмтседі, то есть мысалға бізге именно point C ді Тап десе, вот, не ол, вообще, point C деген не, да, давайте задумайся, point C деген не. Point C, this is intersection, because meet деген сөз, значит, да, meet деген просто встречамес, meet тут означает именно intersection еще. Intersection деген именно қилсу деген сөз, да, пересечение, хорошо? Давайте, чтобы более-менее, андай, не бол үшін, қилсу. То есть пересечение еще. Да? Аха, так, я не вспоминаю. Пересечение кезінде қалай еді. То есть, егер мен қазір L, L1-ның ә, тендеуін білсем, мұн, допустим, мен де білеміз ғо, linear function бұл y is equal to m1x plus c1 жасы сақ болады. This is called slope intercept form, yeah? where m1, this is slope, okay, where the m, m1, this is called slope, C1, this is called y-intercept. Okay? If I know L1, if I know L2, L2 is the same representation, eh? M2x plus C2, how I I can find the coordinates of C? Смотрите, когда ухшылар сөздерден intersection да сыраған кезде, always remember that you need to solve some system, eh? Solve some system of equations. Неге именно system? So system деген сөз оқшылар, бізде бұл дейтін сөз, то есть там именно бірінші тендеугеде и келесі тендеугеде ортақ нүктен табу. Яғни, ну, балашылай шықында там общие точкен табу. А общие точки деген менде не ет? Сол, ванағы точка пересечения. Сынтын ба? То есть, вот, что мы хотим найти? C. Как находим, да? Решаем вот это вот это вот эту систему да вот давайте начали хвастать так вообще хвастать то есть решаем систему да ага инде систему решать эту хатта кинемес но калай калай что вол волш нигерик мане волш ман нигер волш ман начали да м ван мин си ван ага инде мине срагаланда да калай мин уларда табам мин уларда калай табам дейсе вот бренчи сраг вот вот санкин find M1, C1, да? потом M2, C2. Ага, все, теперь вспоминаем. Инде, давайте, пока забыли про L2, давайте решаем L1. Да? 
l 1 да, менде главный зад сол M1 был группа, не месе, давайте он, чтобы L1 был он, M L1 был, да. So, давайте на хайлайс, the line L1 passes through 80. Здесь point парад, minus 1 and 3. Okay, we have some point. And this is parallel to OB. Хорошо, на OB дегенде, егер дұрстап қарайтын болсақ, мұн қаным, мұн қаныңызды, OB дегенде дұрстап қарайтын болсақ, не көртіп тұрмыз? Біз деген бір лайнды көртіп тұрмыз, где именно точка O, 0 де 0, точка B, бұл менде 3 де 1. Енді қарашо, енді given two points, how we can find Slope, yeah. Slope ты не сидел, ушла он тау полюнский реге. Давайте как поговорим про это. Смотрите, где по идее, if I have two points, so, допустим, A, yeah, whose coordinates are x A and B, which is uh, x B y B, uh, slope is y B minus y A x B minus x A. Yeah? То есть и ер минди ика координата болсая. То есть смотрите, менеджер де на на как, не знаю, там X O, Y O, на на X B, N Y B деп алсак. Именно оса O B дин слоп ранде. Именно O B дин слоп ранде. One minus zero, three minus zero. Oh, this is one third. Все, то есть Именно осы формуланы пайдалану арқылы біз дейтін слопты тау балды. Біз дейтін әжерден слопты тау балды. Хорошо. Енді, смотрите, бұл маған несімен көмектеседі. Бұл маған несімен көмектеседі. Бізден андай бір не бар етті прайлы бар. If one line is parallel to next line, their slopes are equal. Давайте мен отдельны бір видеода Ниге кенін дәлелдей мені, бірақ қазір дәлелдей мәк қой қаршы. Енді менің бір L1-ым дейтін менде бар, паралел, басында не дейді? OB-ға дейді ғы? OB-ға паралел. Значит, ML1 тем бұл керек MOB-ға е. Қазір біздің тауығамыз не? MOB. Значит, маған керек мұна жердегі M1, то есть ML1. Бұл менде неге тен, оказыса, үштен бұл. Круто, да? То есть мұжа Уже мына пунктты таптықты. Енді давайте C1-ды қалай тау олсақ болады. Окей, for this point, we will use something called point slope form. Something called point slope form. Point slope form, as name suggests, we need to have one point. One point, let's say some XP and YP and slope. If I have one point and slope, I can easily write the equation as y minus yp time is equal to m times x minus xp. Okay, let's use this. So here we have slope and point a. So it means that I can easily write my l1. So l1 is what? y minus 3. y minus 3 is equal to... One third x minus minus one or plus one. Yes. Okay, cool. So now we have first equation y is equal to one third x plus. Uh, okay, here we have three. Okay, ten third. Cool. Now we know my first equation. So my job is to find sequentially the l two. Okay, for l two, what I know. I know that L2, this is perpendicular to AB. Okay, let me give you some hint. If one line is perpendicular to the next line, their slopes has the following ratio. Okay, so again, I will try to prove in the separate video, but for now, let's use the fact. Okay, if I have this one, It means that if my L1 is, uh, okay, sorry, if my L2 is parallel to AB, it means that the slope of L2 times slope of AB is minus 1. Okay, so I need to find slope of 
L2, but I need to know what is slope of AB. So how can I find AB? Again, I have two points. I can use this formula. Okay, I can use this formula and find the slope. Okay, cool. So M. Okay, what was A and B? Okay, let me write here. A is minus 1 and 3. B was uh, 3 and 1. Cool. So M is just 1 minus 3. 3 minus minus 1, which is plus 1. Eh? Or oh, this is just minus 1 half. Okay, if my AB, M, M, A, B, this is minus 1 half. My M, L, 2. This is what? Times M, A, B. This is minus 1. Or M, L, 2. This is just minus 1 over M, A, B. Or this is minus 1 over minus 1 half. Or this is equal to 2. Cool. So I know my 2. So M, L, 2. This is equal to 2. And 1 point on L, 2. One, it is passes through B. Yeah? So this point. 3 and 1. Again, I have one point and slope. Uh, slope. That's it. So it means that, again, I can use point slope formula to find the equation. y minus 1 is equal to 2 times x minus 3. So y is equal to 2x minus 6 plus 1 or 2x minus 5. Cool. Now, guys, I know all the details that in order to find the coordinates of C. Yeah? So that's why, guys, let's then use them and find the coordinates of C. Okay, this is the first equation. Yeah? Okay, this is the first equation. This is the second equation. So, and the last task is find C. So in order to find C, okay, I'm repeating it again. We need to solve system. Yeah? So... First system was y is equal to 1 third x plus 10 over 3. Second was just 2x minus 5. Okay, we can equate both sides and we will have some equation in terms of x. 2x minus 5 is equal to x over 3 plus 10 over 3. So it means that this is 2x Okay, let's multiply all the sides by 3. Yeah? So 6x minus 15 is x plus 10. So 5x, this is 25. Cool, x is 5. Now x is 5 and y is just 2 times 5 minus 5, which is 5. Cool, now I have my coordinates. It means that... My C has coordinate of 5 and 5. Okay, guys, that's it. So this is how we are going to approach. So, yeah, this was a long, but I, I, I'm, uh, my, my mission is to give you the path of solving yeah? that you, your, uh, how you will solve complex uh, problems, how you will approach it. Yeah? So this is my aim and I hope that it was clear and you understood that. Okay, guys, so good luck on your preparation and see you later.